It's beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Lige Fjord Microbrewery and it's a bottle of Robert's Red Hot Mama coming in at 6.5% ABV. There's a look at the label. Looks really good. There's the bottle cap. Let's get the beer out into a glass and see what we get. Big shout out to Robert. Big shout out to Rooney from Lige Fjord Microbrewery. Nice bit of smoke on the bottle opening. Beer in the glass then. The guys at Lighty Field and Microbrewery and Robert were kind enough to email me an MP3 and give me copyright rights to play the song. It's an actual song. Um, I'm going to give a shout out to the song. Um, I couldn't get it to my, sometimes my tech mind is rubbish. I couldn't get it to work. I couldn't get this song that this beer is based on. Couldn't get it to work. Um, so my apologies on that side. I'm just going to give a shout out to Robert Rooney and Robert's Red Hot Mama. Check it out. Check it out probably on the iTunes store or the Google Play store or whatever it is you buy music. Wherever you go. Um, Spotify or something like that. Check out Robber's Red Hot Mama. We've got a two finger slightly off white head. It's a red ale, most definitely a red ale in the glass. Good levels of carbonation. Hazy, let's get the aroma. Terrific. Terrific aroma on this beer. Punchy, punchy red beer is how I'm gonna describe it. There's some grapefruit. There's some Biscuity red malts, maybe a bit of spicy rye, peppery, really hoppy, orange peel, fleshy blood orange. Let's dive in. Cheers, everybody. That tastes really good. Stone the Crows. Stone the Crows, what a great looking beer. Great tasting beer, great smelling beer. It's a good package, this one. Very berry-like on the back end. Maybe there's some, a touch of kind of raspberry or cherry. It's very tart-like, is what I'm trying to say. Strawberry. <sighs> Lots of bready, biscuity malts coming through. Nutty, There's some licorice coming through, grapefruit. Really good tasting beer. I was actually at the brewery. First of all, I met Robert at a beer festival at the it was the Norwegian, the, the, the Bergen Beer Festival in September. Glorious couple of days of sunshine. Oh, it seems such a long time ago now, it was six months ago. Amazing, amazing time. Uh, beautiful sunshine. The beginning of autumn. Um, it was beautiful, the, the sun was shining, it was warm, we drank loads of beer. It was incredible, really incredible time. met Robert. We then met Robert at the brewery when we did the collaboration. Robert was sorting out the recipe for this beer. Yeah, I'm a massive fan of Norway. I love Norway. It's a beautiful country. Okay, it's a bottle conditioned beer. Look at the colour now on that beer. It's a chestnut coloured ale. Tastes fantastic. Quite rich. Then dry. Then goes back to being a little bit sweet. Biscuit malts coming through. Nuttiness, some licorice, grapefruit, orange peel. It's a really, really good beer. 
very tart like on the back end and a nice bitterness right on the back end there. Uh, Elijah Field microbrewery, it's all in Norwegian uh, so I can't can't describe the, the label to you, but check it out. Liza Fjordan's Robert's Red Hot Mama. Rating for that beer then. I like that enough to give it a Stone the Crows, nine out of 10. So nine out of 10 from Reload Craft Beer. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom and cheers.